stay, can you say? Are the doors early light? Welcome, boys and girls, to the stream. I can't tell. It's a specific holiday, at least here in the America region. And we're going to be selling that a bit differently, a bit juicier. And for the first time ever on any Chubbs or stream, we have a guest for this most special occasion. Joey, get in here. You can look a bit, you can look like almost as big Joey as I do. Yeah, you can take this. Uh, you can't be seen. Uh, I, I, yeah. This is my brother Joey. Wow. Who, I mean, you can kind of tell already. You can kind of tell already who's more uh, ethically American here. Well, we don't know. So today I've constructed, I've gathered some very detailed, intelligent quizzes and tests off the internet, which we all know is the most intelligent and great place that only shares the truth. And we will be seeing which one of us is more American. Now, I've had this here before. This is called the demon spoon. You can tell because the little, can't really see it, but the little line, that means it's the demon spoon. And on the demon spoon, of course, as always, uh, goes hot sauce. Whoever gets a lower score, whoever is, uh, one of us is less American, has to drink the hot sauce. Okay, okay. And it's like, it's going to be a big spoonful, too. It's not going to be like many, many proportions of hot sauce. This is a huge, old, let's get a bit more in. This is a huge old proportion of hot sauce. So, uh, yeah, let's see. Because <laughs> we have to punish the non-Americans. So who's ever less American will be punished. <laughs> okay, first question. You want to go first or should I? Oh, we should, we should, um, we should, no, you should get out of the room and then I take it. And then when you come back in the room, we'll take it together. And like, I'll just do your answer. Okay, so leave for a sec, Joe. Get out of here. I don't like you. Get shoe. <sighs> Finally, it's all. He got me a very nice, generous man. Who's great. Hey, guys, the actual cool person's back. Look at him with his amazing hat. And I'm pretty sure this is a t table cover. I don't know how Joey the scoundrel is going to do it. But here in America, we do everything totally, <laughs> totally legitly. And <laughs> never has, we never have any problems at all, ever. <laughs> Today, let's see how we do on this quiz. This is a horrible question. I have a different one. We're going to the other one. This one sucks. This is literally just like, Americans suck. They're stupid. They're fat. They're dumb. We're going to a different... We're trying a different quiz. This, this, I, 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 like, like if it was joking, but that's just kind of stupidly dumb. I don't like that. <laughs> like, I, I agree wrong, that we're not the wrong, best wrong. country, but we're not all fat, stupid, and dumb. Now, there's obesity, obesity problem, and I'm stupid, but come on. That's just mean. So we're switching over to this one. <laughs> How American are you? Or are you most thankful for, for on Thanksgiving Day? Freedom, family, food. Uh, food, family, freedom. Freedom or family, freedom or family, freedom or family. I'm going to say family. The metric system sure does suck, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Inches and pounds, baby. Baby, I have no idea how to use the metric system. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense in any circumstance. Why would you ever want to use it? This cape thing is hot because it's a table cover. Oh, metric system sucks. <laughs> Which American hero do you most identify with? Washington for his leadership, Franklin for his scientific... But, like, none. Where's, like, the actual American heroes? You got, like... Uh, I don't know who's, like, an actual American hero. Hulk Hogan. Hulk Hogan, Chuck Norris, uh, Bob Ross. Like, the actual heroes. I want the actual heroes on this list, please. Can we get an update on here? Which do you believe should be emphasized more in the American education system? Critical thinking, real-life business skills, conversations, the influence of other cultures... God and country. God and country all the way through. I only want to serve God in my country. What does the phrase, the pursuit of happiness, mean to you? Building a home and family, building a business, creating a better world for everyone, expressing myself. I, guess, I mean, obviously, creating a better world for everyone is obviously the answer. And who saved Fran France's ass back in World War II? America, I think some other countries may have also been involved. Yeah, in World War II, there wasn't just America. What's the best part of America's most popular unofficial holiday, the Super Bowl? Friends, family, and alcohol, the commercials, the game. Uh, I think sports are a waste of our precious time. Who's ever this bottom one, I want to sue you or fight you. You pick. You pick spot. You pick time. I come there. I beat you up. It's very simple. Uh, the commercials are always fun. The sound of multiple languages being spoken in international countries like Washington, D.C. is that's just life. No biggie. A bit disconcerting, more English piece. Good for business, global economy, here we come. Music to my ears. 
a bit disconcerting. How dare, how dare people speak other language? Who thinks that? Who actually thinks that? Anyway, that's just life. No biggie, man. Uh, Good for business. Go, Akana. Here we come. Music to my ears. Sure, why not? Which class of Americans do you feel is getting the short end of the stick these days? The poor? I would say the poor. Because poor people, I don't care how you look at it, they get a short stick. Their stick is they can maybe eat once a day. You are a global citizen and you are 100% American. 100, 100% American. Perhaps you or your parents are not originally from America, but that doesn't make you any less welcome or any less American. There is no denying your international flair. So live it up. We're all the melting pot of the world. After all, now there's only one to see the results. How American are you? We are the global citizen and 100% American. Now, my family's been in America for like 300 years. So that's kind of wrong. But we are 100% American. <laughs> good luck. Good luck, Joe. I just have to say good luck. <laughs> you have no chance. <laughs> You're actually so bad. Joey, get in here. He has no chance. Don't tell him. This Joey, welcome back. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. hey take a seat. Uh, yeah. The other quiz was stupid and uh, a bit, I want to say, uh, it, it, it was too demeaning on Americans. So we're taking this quiz because it's more nice to Americans. Okay, Joy, you ready? Drink all this. Is that what you're ready for? Hey, all for you. Me. All for you. Uh, I got it for Christmas, so hopefully they're not rotten. Here, this will give you some power. That, that, will make you, that will make you win. You have to sing the national anthem, though. Okay, what are you most thankful for on Thanksgiving Day? Mother Earth, freedom, family feud, food. Family feud. Family feud. Are you most? Family. Okay, Joey, it's okay. family food. Okay, uh, always family. So your answer is family. Sure. Uh, okay. Okay. All right, freedom. The metric system sure does suck, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Inches and pounds, baby. Well, I don't know. This has some advantages. We go. Yes, it does. It's just a pounds, baby. No idea how the metric system works. Uh, which American hero do you most identify with? Uh, Washington, Washington, Franklin, Jefferson, Lincoln, Martin Luther King. So here's my problem with this one. It has no actual American heroes on it. Okay, wait. You don't got uh, Chuck Norris, uh, Hulk Hogan, Bob Ross. Uh, what was that one guy's name with the two? John Henry. No actual... John Cena, no hey, actual Arnold. American heroes. <laughs> why is John Cena? Why are hey. those? Because I, they're uh... famous. <laughs> I don't know why I think John Cena. Washington. 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 Okay, Washington for his leadership. Yeah. Washington. Joey loves Washington. What does the phrase "the pursuit of happiness" mean to you? Building a home and family, building a business, creating a better world for everyone. Expressing myself. Yeah. The, what is the pursuit yeah. of happiness? Never what makes you happy? Let's build a business. Build a business. Building a business. Why not? What's the best part of the American's most popular unofficial holiday, the Super Bowl? This is how I want to speak in the rest of it. Oh, we can do it in New Jersey, too. Hey, this is how I want to speak in the rest of it. <laughs> uh, is that the commercial? I think so, the, the commercial. wait, friends, family. Okay, commercials. It's a commercial. Commercials. Which of the following would you consider America's greatest strength? Our natural resources. Our multiculturalism. Our economy. Our constitution. Our traditions. I mean, traditions are kind of sucky. I, I can't think of one tradition we have in America. Anyway, uh, uh, yeah. Anyway, what do you what do you think? What is a multiculturalism? Uh, multiculturalism, the old melting pot. Ah, uh, so it's how we have all these different cultures, which you can see culture in uh, the world. Let's go with multiculturalism. Okay, a multiculturalism. Which class of Americans do you feel is getting the short end of the stick these days? The poor, minorities, the middle class, job creators. We're all going to be on the short end of the stick. Wait, sorry. We're all going to be on the short end of the stick unless we do something about the environmental protections. Of course. Which one do you pick, That one's man? the longest. Um, right. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Okay, Joe, you ready for your results? Get results. It's cleaning up. Analyzing your responses. You are a captain of capitalism, <laughs> and you are... You are a hundred percent American. I mean, you understand that money makes the world go round, and that American's power is amplified by her extraordinary spirit. Progress, after all, is often driven by profit. Therefore, you see the American dream of freedom from want as one of the most noble pursuits a person can engage so in. Uh, I also was a hundred percent American. 
I want to do the quiz again to see if it does not make a difference. Wait, wait, let's see, let's see the other. It, yeah, yeah, you have to be 100% American. But, so, here's the thing. What? You can either, I, but I got a global citizen, and you got capitalist. So, which one's more American, global, or capitalist? So, I'm thinking, you know, because uh, America is such a mixing pot that, the global citizen is definitely more American than the capitalist one. Yeah, but you know, like most America, capitalism, you know, that's kind of the American big the capitalist. So, are you trying to tell me? Fine, I, I, yeah, there's no way that uh, the global citizen beats the uh, capitalist yeah, yeah. in an American fight. Yeah, no. Who's Amer American? I've been Monopoly. I know how to capitalist. Okay, fine. You can be on the king of Monopoly. Okay, we're fine, 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 fine. So I told you that one stupid little flag of yours is going to save you. So, Joey, please put on these headphones. Wow, did I win? Yeah, yeah you won, you won. Did I get to come on now? No, no, this, this, is, this, is your, um, this is your victory. Oh, I win this, so much. This is your victory. Uh, actually, look away for a second. Anyway, Joy, that's your present. Let me start pouring on the hot sauce for mine. Is it? Does it sound great? Does it sound great, Joe? Sorry, yeah. I can't hear it all. It has. Is it great? Is it amazing? Was it a good present? Well, it's like one of those things where they're like big break. And even this 11 like, year old, you know, people like that thing where like, they said, We're like, I said, Before it actually televised a major league soccer game, like that. In a stadium, this is supposed to be, wait, wait. Fans, well, just this listen. is supposed to be the worst national anthem ever. Uh, is this person just being mean? 11 year old Harper Grusins had oh, it's like an actual interview. Was it, was it bad, Joey? I mean, it wasn't like. Like, I don't want to be. I mean, <laughs> was it bad? Like, no. Like, there doesn't want to be mean to the person he's never gonna meet ever. Yeah, I am. Not. Okay, but uh, now, is it bad? The worst thing ever. Like, it, you could probably do worse. Oh, sir. <laughs> Yeah, it's not horrible. Like she's, like, she's just like she's just dragging it out a bit too long. Well, yeah, that's like that. That's why I don't like about that music. Like some people like do that. Okay, well I lost. Drag things out. Let's let's get like the hot ones music in here. It's gonna suck. Wait, smell yeah, it. Never been. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's so what bad. Walk them. Chubs or. I think this is a bit more watery than it's supposed to. I, I've done this on oh, video before. Not. That's not as bad as this. I should wait. Wait. I think the initial whiff is always the worst. Yeah. Like, as soon as you open it, it's like condensed, spicy, bad air. Well, now you, like, this is more water. Like, this is just like water. All right. Demon spoon. I hate this thing. This is the worst. I think this might be qualified as the worst spoon of all time. America! Yeah! Oh, Joey, Joey, we need some epic pickle juice. We need some epic American music to like sign us off. This is for America. This is how we do it. We drink hot stuff off of a spoon and we cry about it. Hopefully not. I. Uh... Right, I gotta go. Okay, Joey really has to go. So Joey, help me pour that. I found way so much. So much. So much. Here's the pickles. You get, you get high belly. Oh, thank you. The pickles are so nice. It's very nice. Right, give me some hype, Joe. Give me some hype. Hype, 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 well, Joey, you, Joey has to leave, so Joey, you go now. Uh, oh, it's so bad. You're not going to say bye? Uh, uh, bye, Joe. Okay, he just left without his name. Oh, 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 my God. It's so bad. 
Jesus. <laughs> it's so rancid. Oh. Ugh. It's... <laughs> it's not good. It's not good. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, scroll down, subscribe, so I can never do this again. And maybe unless you want me to do it next year. Oh, it's so bad. I'm going to wear this for the rest of the stream, by the way. Uh, if you want to see the stream, check it out. Chubzor. for twitch.tv forward slash Chubzor. I'm really just... My brain ain't working too well. But uh, yeah, thank you all so much for watching and uh, see you next video or next stream. I don't really know. So until then, salute. Say uh, goodbye, ladies and gentlemen.